thankful. I'm thankful for Netflix. Yeah. I'm thankful for Go Stop. The only thing that can get me to stop watching Netflix. I'm thankful for Michael Jackson and YouTube because making my late students moonwalk into the classroom is the most entertaining punishment ever. I'm thankful for Jung Wan Kimchi because now all others are five star. I'm thankful for Ron Jung making the memories of college seem not quite so distant. For Soju, helping my vice principal be a little less intimidating. For fried chicken, the one thing I can eat better than everyone in my host family. I'm thankful for Jop Che because when my host father tiptoed behind my mother to sneak me a taste before dinner, feeding me from his own hand as if I was a newly hatched baby bird. It was then that I knew I had a Korean family. I'm thankful that strolling in the streets of Busan on a Chris Knight lit by Gungali Bridge. I'm thankful that women don't see me clutch their purse and scramble as if I had a sign stapled to my head reading guilty. I'm thankful that store clerks still follow me around. But here they're trying to slip me into $500 jackets instead of pursuing I'm trying to slip out with $5 worth of snacks stuffed into my pockets. I'm thankful. I'm thankful that, fine, thank you, and you have been retired. <laughs> now the kids talk. The big kid tells you why he and Winnie the Pooh are the same. Cute face, big tummy, love for honey. <laughs> his small head. The quiet kid whispers, I actually enjoy English. The bad kid became such a rebel that he actually wanted to participate, and best of all, last Tuesday, Sleeping Beauty stayed away. <laughs> I'm thankful for Ajumas and Ajashis. I'm thankful for my crazy hair and Korean people's curiosity. I'm thankful most of all for tonight's turkey. But I'm also thankful for Fulbright and my Fulbright family for giving me so many chances to be thankful in this country.